Hello and welcome back everyone. I'm going to show you how to use Docker to chew root into any operating system you desire. Pull up a computer and let's get started. Docker images will show you which base images are currently installed on the system. I have a couple that I'm using for some neural nets. We're going to go ahead and just do Ubuntu. So first step, we're going to make a directory called Ubuntu. And as you can see right now, I'm running Debian. So my goal is to be running Ubuntu by the end of this inside of a true root. So docker pull Ubuntu. That's, this is an official tag, so it's pretty easy to download, and it's supported and maintained by those Docker folks. Now I need to start an instance of the base Docker image. Docker run git ubuntu bash. All right, so this is now inside the Docker image. And you can see it is Ubuntu 16.04.04 LTS. Um, but that's just using the regular Docker method. How do we get in here via chew rooting? Well, we're going to leave this bash session open, come into a new root terminal. Docker PS shows us that this is the container ID of that running instance. So this is where the magic happens, and we can dump the root file system. It dumps by default to STD out, which is literally the screen output, but you need to redirect that to a file um, with the redirect thing. So docker export from the container ID, then the redirect to a file, root.tar. What we just did there is we wrote an ar archive of the entire root directory into that root.tar file r-xvf root.tar. This will extract to my current working directory, which is fortunately a temp directory I've made. ls again, and we have a root file system. From here, it's a standard chew root. So for i in dosis proc do mount dash dash r bind slash dollar sign i slash dot slash dollar sign i done chew root the current working directory then we're going to mount everything then we're going to su to myself instead of root environment variables and we're going to make sure we're running the right operating system and just like that, we've chew rooted into a Docker image. Anything in the Docker repositories is a chew root, potentially. So that's pretty cool. Thanks for watching. Bye.